sweeties and welcome back to my channel and this video where I'm just gonna put some makeup on because I have so many things that I want to show you but I just never get to and today I am filming my new makeup releases after this so you will have seen this makeup look before and it has been in one of my new makeup releases going on the wishlist or not and I just I just want to sit down and play with makeup I don't want to do anything specific I just want to have fun so I decided to play with some of my trying to organize myself some of my single shadows that I haven't shown you that much on my channel. So I have a bunch of different items on my eyes and sorry about my pets in this video, they're wild. I'm using Neve Cosmetics, I am using Sugar Pill and I am using Colored Rain. I'm also using a loose pigment, the one you're seeing on my lid. I was very inspired by the color placement by a girl on Instagram and I will link her down below and I will also chat more about that once we get into the tutorial because she has a very cool placement of like lower, lower color placement. Wow, grammar. Not having, not having the best time with that, are we? <laughs> but yeah, let's just get into the look. Thank you for being here and let's get this show on the road. Okay, so I have basically all of my face makeup on, my eyebrows and everything. I just don't have my lips and my eyeshadow on and like my, my eye makeup. Because I do have a primer on, do I? Yeah. Um, and it's dried down, so it is pretty dry, but it doesn't feel like powdery because I didn't set it with any powder. And I'm just going to play with these eyeshadows. I'm going to let you know what I do when I do it. These are Colored Rain, these are Sugar Pill, and these are uh, Neve Cosmetics. It is Neve Cosmetics and not Neve Cosmetics, apparently, because this is an Italian brand. And when I said um, Neve Cosmetics to my boyfriend, he started laughing. Because he's Italian, he's like, what are you trying to say? I don't know, I don't know. And they were out of Coke Zero, so I got Coke Light. So offended by that, let me tell you. So I think I'm gonna do... I was very inspired... Oh, here it is. I was very inspired by a makeup account, a Swedish girl called Alice. I'm gonna see if I can find her, like, the picture that I saw, and I'll put it here on the side, because... Her, her name is Alice Englund, and she does the most amazing looks with a lot of like eyeshadows lower down. I will put some pictures here on the side, and I was thinking that I want to do something with eyeshadow like lower down as well. I think that that is so cool, and I really love how she does it. Like it's really cool. So I'm gonna do something. I want to do like purples and greens and blues because I've been really into greens and blues. Let me zoom in a bit. So I really want to do something, I think I'm going to do purple, blue, green and a cut crease and then just a lot of eyeshadow down here. I will also leave her Instagram down below in case you want to go follow her because like her Instagram account is really popping and she doesn't have that many um, followers and I don't know why because she's so good. So I am going to start with, I think I'm going to start with this one. This is Perp Smurf, this is actually... I have swatched these next to each other. This is pretty much a dupe for Poisonberry by Sugar Pill. And they are dupes. They are dupes and they swatch pretty similarly. Uh, I just haven't tried the colored rain uh, eyeshadows that much, so I wanted to try that one. So I am going to start with that one that's called Perp Smurf and I'm going to put that. <sighs> my cat and my dog is out on the balcony, so if you hear some background noises. That's them. I'm gonna put that in my. So I'm gonna put that in my outer corner. Why? Why is this? Why is this not cooperating? Stupid, stupid palette. Okay, I'll put it over here. Ah, okay. Wait. Why is this so far away? I need to get my mirror in as well. And I'm thinking that I'm maybe gonna do a cool toned lip with this. Oh, this is beautiful. So I'm going to put this on and I am going to mainly put this in the outer corner and the outer part of the crease and I'm going to blend it out with this one. It's also by Color Drain. It is called Cute. It's like a lavender. So I'm going to use that one to blend it out. I think I'm going to put some music on top of this because I just want to play a bit. I usually don't put music on my videos but... I thought that maybe today I will because I don't know if I want to be talking, I just want to be playing. To be fair, I could have just 
film this like I could have just done this makeup and not filmed it but if I did I know I would have gotten so many people asking me to film it so I might as well just film it what's going on seems like somebody's like the getaway car from a bank robbery <laughs> maybe it is this color is right now this is looking so pretty I do have another dupe for you it is this one that is called neo blue wait I need to organize myself a bit better because this is awful and this one from sugar pill that's called velocity these are exactly the same in tone but neo blue swatches so much better than velocity and for that reason I want to use velocity on my eyes today just to see if if it's not that pigmented or like because it, I mean just because something doesn't swatch that good doesn't mean that it's not good so I'm gonna use that color on my eyes just to see if it's any good on the eyes because it doesn't swatch as good as the neo blue so I'm putting that here next to the purple and then I'm gonna have green on the inside I'm gonna um, use this one that's called What's this, what is this one called? The light blue, home sweet home. I had that in the palette, the, sh the sugar pill palette, and I hated that color in the palette. So I, but I've heard that the single is better, so I bought this. I bought a color I don't like in a single. Yes, I am that stupid, but I've heard that the single is better, so I am gonna blend this blue out with that one. I'm also gonna put some here. It is really nice on the lids though, this Velocity. Velocity, not Velocity. <laughs> oh god, sometimes. So I don't think I'm gonna have more than that. I'm gonna use the Home Sweet Home now to see if I can blend this out. And I am switching to a smaller brush. I am using this for the darker color and then I'm blending them out with a lighter color and a similar br brush but smaller. These are both from Hakahodo, the ones that I bought when I was in, in Japan. And I feel like it's really hard to find precise blending brushes uh, from inexpensive brands. I do have two from Morphe but they are so scratchy so I try to not use them unless I have a shadow that's very stiff and need a scratchier brush. And these are definitely not that. I'm going back with the purple now and just blending it into the blue, making sure that I have like the intensity that I want in the blend between the colors. That is pretty cool. Maybe I want it to be a bit more blue here. I'm gonna do the same on the other eye as well. well hopefully, <laughs> you never know. I think that is pretty similar. I don't have any fallout at all. So now I'm gonna go into some green and lime. Hmm, these are pretty similar as well. Like the the one that's called Midori. This one has a bit of shimmer in it, but it doesn't show on the eyes. It's just to help with the blending. And the one that's called Level Up. Level Up has a little bit more of yellow in it, and neither of these swatch very good. But I know that at least Midori works really good on the eyes. I also have some greens from this one, but I don't think I'm gonna use these greens because they're more muted, but I love that. Like, can you see the difference? Like, these are more like grass green and lime, and these are more like muted foresty greens. And I really like that though, but I am gonna use some of the shimmers that I have for this look. 
Uh, but I'm not gonna use the mattes from this, but I have used the greens on the eyes once before and I actually did like it. Uh, but I'm gonna use some of those shimmers. So I think I'm gonna go into, I don't think I'm gonna use the yellow. So I think I'm gonna go into, I have used that on my eyes, so I am gonna use this from Color Drain, the Level Up one. And then I'm gonna blend it out to this one that is the lime green from Sugar Pill that is called Acid Berry. So that's how I'm gonna use it. It's hard sometimes, but to be fair, I mean, I want to try as many of the shadows as possible on my eyes that I haven't used, and I just want to see how they are. So this is the Level Up by Color Drain. That is not that impressive though. Okay, maybe, maybe, okay. I took a bit more color and that is, that is better, yeah. I am really, really liking this. I love these three colors together. I'm gonna do, like I said, some kind of cut crease so that I can have something brighter on the lid. I've been really into that lately as well. Well, isn't that super fun? That's nice. So I am, now I'm gonna do, I'm gonna wait for the lower lash line to last because I wanna do something really like blown out. Yeah, I think so. What is this? Go away. So I think I'm gonna cut my crease um, and then I'm gonna put, I'm gonna cut my crease and I'm gonna put green and then green shimmer, I think. I'm gonna use this green shimmer, which is the one from Neve Cosmetics called Matcha. I'm gonna put that one on the lid and I think I'm gonna put some kind of pigment over. I'll just, I'll cut the lid and I'll come back. I'm gonna use the ColourPop concealer. It's gonna be how I always do it. And I'll be right back. Okay, so this is, this is where we're at. I'm gonna use that matcha now. If you hear something in the back, background like that, my cat is having a seizure. No, <laughs> no, she's, she's very energetic and she likes like really, I'm, I'm not gonna spray this. I'm just gonna pat it on the concealer. She just likes running around and letting the dog chase her. She really, really loves that. So I'm just gonna put this matcha all over the lid, but not here at the end, because I am gonna meet up with some of the like shades I had before there. And I got a little bit of fallout, because that normally happens when I don't spray my shimmers. This is looking really cool. Okay, I'm gonna take a little bit of the blue. What did I use? I used the Velocity, too many palettes. And I'm gonna follow up with the lime green next to it. So I'm just gonna tap over here to make this transition a bit. we're ending up with just a bit of a green purple blue action I'm gonna do the same on the other one okay so I did find a pigment that I want to use you always ask me to use my Tammy Tanuka like my sigil inspired pigments so I found one that's who I have no idea what this is called I will put the name down below hopefully I'll find it it is a green gold shimmer and I'm gonna put that just pat it on top of the shadow that I have, the shimmer one. I don't know if you can see anything, probably not. I'm gonna... <sighs> These animals. This is what it looks like in the lid, you can see. So I'm gonna take a bit of that and I'm gonna pat it over the shadow. I'm gonna use a bit of glitter glue if I can find it. You know what? Let me find my glitter glue. Where is my glitter glue? One sec. Okay, so I found it. This is the e.l.f. one. Uh, this is the one that I'm using. I do have both Too Faced and uh, NYX, but I think they are pretty similar to each other. Unless you have very like oily lids, maybe then there will be a difference, but for me there's not a difference. Uh, 
so I'm using this one and I'm gonna just cover the area and then we'll pat it on. Okay, going in with the pigment, I have it on the brush. Oh, what? That is stunning. Oh my god, have I owned this pigment for like months and not used it and it's looking this good? <gasps> oh, that, that, mm, that is so stunning. So I'm just, I don't know if you can, if I can, do you see the difference? It's so shimmery in real life. Oh my god. Oh, this is so beautiful. Oh wow. So yeah, I'm just patting that over, cleaning my brush on my Veramona color switch, and I'm just tapping on the edge here to have it just fade out a bit. But yeah, that is spectacular. Woo! Okay, let me do the same on the other eye, and I'm gonna do a bit of black liner, and then I'll come back and we can do the lower lash line, because I really want to smoke it out just like uh, Alice does, because it looks amazing on her, and hopefully it will look somewhat okay on me your fingers <laughs> okay so I checked out Alice pictures now of how I'm gonna do this and I think I'm gonna hmm I'm gonna use my bigger brush and I'm gonna use that purple that I used on top and I'm just gonna oh, a little fallout really smoke out the outer place here and then I'm she always does lighter on the inside so I think I'm gonna have lighter on the inside too. I don't know if I'm gonna have... this is cool. I don't know if I'm gonna have like this shimmery green. I think I'm gonna use one of the shimmery ones from Neve Cosmetics. This is pretty intense but pretty cool. I'm taking the smaller brush now and I'm taking that uh, one that's cute, the lavender one. It's called cute <laughs> and it is a lavender one. And I'm blending this out a bit, smudging it even more. This is cool. I think she usually goes in even more, but I don't think I will. That is pretty cool. So I'm gonna put a little bit of blue I think I'm gonna use another blue. I think I'm gonna use this one. It's called, is, it, is this kimchi? What is this called? Yeah, kimchi. The turquoise one. I think I'm gonna put that next to here. Or maybe I'll put it... And I'll leave a little... See, I left something in the inside there. I'm gonna put a white pen there and then I'm gonna go over with some shimmer. Okay, so I'm just gonna use, I'll just use a, this isn't a white pen, this is mint cream. Well, that's perfect then. I'm gonna put that in my waterline and I'm also gonna put that here in the inner corner so that I can put the light blue over. I'm sorry, my pets are going crazy. And now I'm gonna take my detail brush if I can find it. I'm gonna go back to my Nev Neve Cosmetics and I'm gonna use the blue that is called Oxygeno? Oxygeno? Is that, is that somewhere in the neighborhood? Not sure. And I'm gonna put that on top of the like liner I just put. And I'm gonna drag it out a bit over like the turquoise here okay so this is where we're at right now and this is what the eye look is gonna look uh, if you weren't to put any falsies on but I'm gonna put some falsies on and I'm gonna put some lower lash um, mascara as well and what else oh I need something for the lips I'm thinking about a cool tone lip I think I'm gonna put this one on this is this is dirty <laughs> 
This is one of the new NYX suede. This is Munchies. I actually got 11 of these from NYX sent to me and I love the formula so much that I actually ended up buying two more shades. This being one of them. So this is a shade I bought myself. It is a very cool tone taupe. It's called Munchies. So I'm gonna put that one on as well and that's gonna be the finished look. I think. Okay, so that is the finished look and I am adoring this. Oh, I look so fun and my pets are really at it. I mean, to be fair, it's a puppy still and it's a kitten, so I'm only happy that they like to play with each other. And if that means that they're gonna be a bit noisy in the background, so be it. They're part of the family and this is how it is. But yeah, this is the finished look. I will list all the products that I used in this video down in the description box. I always do that so that you can see go back and see what did she use because I did use a bunch of different stuff in this video. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I do upload quite a lot of videos. Right now it's been five to six videos a week and I would love to see you in my next one. Bye!